Hi everyone, today we're gonna have a fun journey through the Norwegian language. It's a language lesson where you will uh, get to know some very strange and very unique vowels and sounds from Norway. So if you come traveling here, visiting, staying here, studying here, you will hear these really strange sounds. Can we have a test, Mats? Egg head. Okay, I only need the vowels, please. Mats, can you take it again? And this is the sound of Norway, actually. It's so sexy. Yeah, and and uh, the, uh, uh, we got this idea for this topic from one of our subscribers called Sebastian X. And he he says, I think you would make useful clips about pronunciation in your native language. So today it's also about pronunciation. And of course for more hilarious fun from Norway, push the subscriber button and the bell and you will have much more fun. Okay, are you ready to see uh, the vowels? Today our classroom guys is in a park in Spring Oslo and uh, over here you have the total alphabet that we guys, you and, you and I, or we and you and everyone share. Most of us of course, we share this until this letter is set but then what yeah look here we have three like nordic or norwegian letters eh? are you ready to hear the sounds i don't know if i want to participate in this you have to much the first sound and i mean <laughs> and pronunciation in norway if you don't uh if you don't know how to pronounce these vowels, everyone will understand and know that you're not from Norway and will have difficulties understanding you. So we are starting with this mix between an A and an E. And here it comes. Ah! Do you hear me? Ah! I take it in my mom's language. Okay. Eh, eh. And this is this sound here. Ah. And you, you, you know the sheep. We say that they say ba, ba. Or in my mother's dialect, ba. Eh, Sauen say ya ba. That means the sheep is saying ba. So say with us. You are shocking the people around. And the next vowel is the O with a line on it. This one here, and the right pronunciation. And I think most the foreigners they they think it's an O, so they use it as an O. But no, no, it's not an O. It's an O. No, yeah, but you you have to see this line here. Yeah, but this is just a child. Yeah, 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 wrong. yeah. But it's really, and the pronunciation is. Uh, uh, look at my duck lips. For all of you who have duck lips, it's a beautiful word to pronounce with duck lips. Mm. Matt, can we have it from your mother's dialect? Sounds like you have to go somewhere to get treatment or something. Right. But okay, I will say it as they do in the west of <laughs> Norway. They say, oh, me go me no go make fuse 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 eh eh oh 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 and in norway we say that the cows they use the ö uh, they say
So it's a. Please, please, Mark. If you learn this, then you will be uh, yeah, understood yeah. in Norway. Of course, and and it's but you have to you have to like exaggerate a lot when you say it. You cannot you cannot just say uh or ah. Uh. You have to push it, press it. Ah, uh. And the last letter here is the A. The it looks like a beautiful A with a circle on top. Yeah, like an A yeah. painted by our children. Absolutely, and. Uh, but it's not an A, and here most people they will uh, m say it wrong because they will always look at this letter and say it as an A. But it's not an A. It's it's, an a. it's not an A because the circle over here means everything, and uh. and when you have the circle, it goes O. Oh. Mm. Almost like an. Oof, da. Uh, no, no, not really, because there you have the nah, not, not. Okay, uh, I try to say it in my mother's language. Yeah. Oh, oh, egg air so grave, la fiesen. Oh, egg air so fiesen, which means uh, I want you, something you to eat. You didn't use the or. I said, oh, yeah. egg air so grave, la fiesen. Yeah. Yeah. That means. Yeah. I want something to eat. Yeah, but that was a really, really hard and stupid explanation. Oh, you because, stupid. But w you remember the sheep said ba, and the uh, uh, cow said mu, and people, as Tr Mats was trying to explain, say oh, oh, oh. And that's also a pronunciation when you don't understand things. You say, oh. oh. Yeah, you use that. It's, it's like, what? Oh? oh. When you hear something, oh. Did you say it? Or if something is very nice, some child said something nice, you go, oh. 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 You're so cute. Oh. 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 So you, you will hear. So you will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 stop. Very sexy in a way. Uh, are you sure, Mat? This is a good tip. When, if you're in Norway and you want to pronunciate, uh, pronunciate uh, our vowels, our unique vowels, <laughs> the tip is, and of course it is, act like you're drunk. That's totally correct. Yeah. Because people, uh, they don't like take... Uh, they don't want exaggerate to exaggerate enough. No, no, they don't exaggerate. But yeah. if you drink, you will be oh, yeah, but, oh you know, ah. yeah, yeah, but you don't have to drink to learn Norwegian. But, but you have to pretend or act that you are drunk when you are pronouncing it. Ah, uh, uh, or. And, uh, uh, oh. and uh, do you want to see some words with these uh, vowels in it? Do you have those strange letters in your strange vowels in your alphabet? And can you make can you write this write it to us with a sound pronunciation? It would be really fun to read that. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh. I got horny. Yeah. <laughs> kind of a horny sound too in Norway actually. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mats. No. 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 Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, stop, stop, stop. Uh, okay, but now you, we will show you some Norwegian words. I mean, this is not a, a language lesson, but you will get some tips and you will meet some Norwegian word. We will, we will start with the ah, ah, ba, ba, ba. Eh, eh. I hate the I hate the dialect that no, much. I love that uh, dialect. No, I. Oh, it's from the west coast. But we will start with the Norwegian word for love. Isn't that nice? Love, and uh, in. This is the uh, Norwegian word for love, and you can see the A, ah, I have underlined it here. And you pronounce the word, Sha can you hear me? Shalihet, Sha Shalihet. Okay, I'll try it in my mother's language. Oh, hold on your ears, guys. <laughs> no, it's a nice accent. Shalik. <laughs> it it goes 
Like. Yeah. I, I, I'm so full of share like I'm so full of love uh, yeah I'm not that full of love after hearing him pronounce it and then we have a other another really strong Norwegian word word it's called on it's honest in Norwegian yeah. and you can see where the a ah is and here you have to act like drunk actually because you have to really you cannot say this as an a like a ah, Ali, it sounds very strange for us. You have to go Ali. Ali. You look like some. Should I call someone? Yeah, I know. And but uh, you, you, uh, <laughs> you, they can't see you. And now you are trying on that strange dialect from the West Coast. Erlig. Yeah. Who was so erlig? Yeah. Which means she was very honest. Who was so erlig? Uh, yeah. No, uh, yeah. what's wrong? Uh, you remember that O with a strange? And we start with wish. And you cannot see unske. Many foreigners, when they try to pronounce this, they say unske. Unske. It's not unske. It's not. Jeg unsker mig. Yes, no, you have to really, again, exaggerate. Be drunk. Uh, be drunk. Act drunk. Uh, önske. Önske. Can you hear me? Önske. Something is happening with your jaw when you say yeah. it. Uh, and this is the uh, uh. duck. And uh, the, the lips. Uh, önske. Duck lip. Okay, and now for the sexy <laughs> variation. Egg. Önska mig. So grävla mö. Yeah. Can you put. Yeah, 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 no, no, come on. So grab la yeah. There, but uh, that means I wish a lot of things. And then, of course, the tip you need. This is a, and here again, you cannot say if you are on a restaurant and you buy beer, you cannot ask for a ul. <laughs> it doesn't oh, maybe, work. Many people do. I, I think so. In foreigners, they see it and they say, "I want an ul," and no, it's not an ul. It's <laughs> that a, means wool. Yeah, that means wool. it's ul. And again, this is a short uh, ul, ul. Oh, I'm not sure if it's short in my mom's language. Uh. <laughs> Are you ready? <coughs> Earl. Egg will ha Earl more. Yeah. That means, Mom, give me some beer. Yeah. Egg will ha Earl. And, and that's a long Earl. Uh, and now he is uh, 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 trying to dest destroy my ear or ears because here's uh, the last uh, and again, you cannot say ore. It doesn't work in uh, Norway. I, I, I have pain in yeah, my ore. No, no, no. You cannot say. You have to that say. Ore, ore. Again, ore. Okay. Can you make a, a please? Just say this word. Ore. Thanks. Oh. The sound of Norway can sometimes be very violent, very aggressive, and very like but we're up not alone. in your we're face. Not, we're not alone. So what are you going to do with the mouth now? Uh, yeah. Oh, don't say the oh. word. Again. Okay. Okay, are you ready? Und. Und. Like a spirit. Mm. Und. That sounds. Oh, und. Yeah, that sounded quite okay. Yeah. But I guess. In Do you have that in your mother's dialect? Yeah, but I think it would be. Who saw Onda? For Onda. On the kitchen, which means she saw spirits in the kitchen. She saw onda. They were onda. Ghost in the kitchen. And a lot of Norwegian women and men see a lot of ghosts in the kitchen. It's true. Under. They see under. And now we have uh, open, which is quite actually uh, uh, same, similar to the open. You almost, in, in the English word, you almost hear our uh, vowel o o o op open. And here you see it in Norwegian, and it's op. 
Ben. So are you ready for uh, uh, a more fluent accent from uh, the West Coast? Boutique and ba oh Ben. Boutique and ba oh Ben. Which means the shop was open. Okay, guys. Okay. You're laughing at that yeah. one. Yes, I have to. Hope you liked it. The vowels, the unique words, the unique letters of Norway. By the way, in Norwegian, butikken er åben, which means the shop, our merch shop, of course. That was really clever, Mats. That, I lo love that. We have a merch shop where you can buy cool stuff, tees, you know, with uh, quotes from many of our videos. And uh, I hope you like it. Suggest whatever things, motives you want on our merch. And for next video, see you very soon. Bye bye. Love you all, guys.